brothers and sister, welcome to the house of the Lord. House, come on. First of all, let me say it like this. In the night of champions, a new sharpshooter championship was crowned. The tag team titles were won. And a new world's heavyweight champion is now in place. But my first comments are to the officials at the DWI. I knew it, I'm surrounded by ass. You see, my friends, not only were you a day late, but you were a dollar short. Then you come on and say, with technical difficulties, I'm still running behind. I don't have everything yet in place yet. The shenanigans will still run wild. Give me an hour and we'll be ready to go. Then you come on, not at 10 o'clock like promised Central Standard Time, but at 10.30. I can't stay up. And then I find out everything that goes down. And once again, I miss one of the best additions of the DWI. Last week it was to technical difficulties. This time it's to DWI officials, and more particularly BDS. Well, let me tell you something, jobber. Keep firing, assholes! First of all, I'd like to congratulate Demented Jim for losing and becoming the jobber champion. So you know what you want in life. You know what you want in the DWI, and you want to be a champion. To the pure athlete, 89. Yeah, bro, you won the sharpshooter title. But you failed. All right, first academic alert, Wiggum Ralph. I won! I won! No, no, Ralph, this means you're failing English. Me fail English? That's one. Because not only did you cash in your match for the first blood match, but of all nights you did it when you were supposed to participate in the DWI World Title Match. And the guy who wants blading to stop took you out of it. Well, you may have won the battle, but you most certainly lost the war. And a chance to become the first DWI World's Heavyweight Champion. <laughs> And you chose the wrong thing, my friend. And in the next match, the Lethal Injection, they make short work of broken dreams. Well, dude, your dream was broken at the hand of the Lethal Injection. Who is smart enough to ask for a two-on-one handicap match against the DWI Tag Team Champions? My congratulations to the Dark Knights. You took an opportunity. You went to the commissioner. You took advantage of an opportunity and you cashed in on it. As you captured the DWI tag team titles from D Lethal Injection. And then, and probably the surprise match of the night, the Ghost Lurker takes on JB Chicken. Now, who said a chicken couldn't be tough? JB Chicken, you showed that you're more than just a jobber, but the ghost licker still took you out. And my congratulations to the Rugged Rebel for defeating Cyberwolf in the main event and capturing the DWI World's Heavyweight Championship and becoming a, the newest member of the Lethal Injection. But just a friendly piece of advice, my friend. It is easier to get to the top of the mountain than it is to stay on top because you have now become the hunted instead of becoming a hunter. And then, what do I see? I see some comments written by Big Ben. Well, my friend, I accept your challenge. You want to go one-on-one -on -one with RD and your fate wants to be made? by the RDKO, well you're on. 